take all necessary steps so we will never, ever, ever again find ourselves in this dire position. Brockton's mayor, Robert Sullivan, is reacting to a 214 page report detailing the shortcomings of Brockton School Department that led to a $23 million deficit last year. The areas of overspending were caused by structural failures, a lack of sound budgeting and financial analysis. An independent law firm found the district superintendent and school committee lacked a rudimentary understanding of managing a $200 million budget. They say because of that, it was largely overseen by one person, the district CFO, Aldo Petranio. It's okay. You made a mistake. Let's rectify it. Nicole Gatling used to bus Brockton Public School students, but the district split from her employer, first student transportation during the pandemic. The district started internally busing its students, which has been highlighted as one of the areas that contributed to the deficit. For those budgets at that time that they gained through the pandemic, they could have taken that money and improved their contract with first student. A number of recommendations have been made, including creating a detailed and transparent school budget, mandating all school committee members undergo annual budget and finance training, and merging the financial operations of the school department and the city of Brockton. This report was truly uh, eye-opening. Uh, it was detailed, it was thorough, but it also put a spotlight on processes that are needed to be put in place. The city solicitor said she will also be forwarding this report over to the attorney general's office as well as the inspector general.